Usually people on the plane ride, they watch movies, but they were playing games. Like everyone around me was playing games and I was so confused and most of them were playing Angry Birds, which was even more disturbing. It, it was, it was scary. The, the Valley Girls, the Valley Girls. Um, it felt like a Disney Channel kind of fake, the people next to me. Yeah, they, they talked like they were in a TV show. They were saying things like, Oh, thanks, Auntie Cory. And then she uh, kissed her aunt, I'm assuming. Like, you know, obviously, you know, Auntie Cory, right? Oh, thanks, Auntie Cory. And then, yeah, like she kisses her on the cheek for switching with another friend of hers, which I assume is the cousin. And then, yeah, they sounded like they were acting, and the aunt said something like, Oh, anything for my, my, my sweet darlings, I love you too. And it was so Disney Channel-like. And then it would say something like, You are so funny! <laughs> and it sounded so fake, I was so confused. The tone is so weird. There was also these random people apart from the valley girls that people across from me they were taking selfies or whatever and this random person going by was like oh would you like a picture they were like oh yeah uh, that would be great and then they took a picture and would say oh my god thank you so much you are so welcome oh my goodness you're such a photographer i'm like whoa what's going on i'm scared bro like, are they normal? It was like uncanny valley. There there was also like a flight attendant asking a person getting on board if they want the window seat. And the person says, oh, yes, please. I always love the window. It, it's so weird because usually when people get on the plane, they're just like, oh, yeah, thanks, man. Like, I'm, I'm done. Like, they don't even say anything. They just want to get stuff over, like, over with. Yeah, they were paid actors. Yeah, I felt like I was in a Truman show or something. And then they said other things like, Oh my god, look at the clouds! They are, like, literally red. Like, <laughs> I'm so, like, confused, bewildered. Like, what what's that mean? What's that mean? And then they were, and they were having trivia. I got so so annoyed because it's one of those um game show stuff so they had greek myth and one of the girls were saying oh yeah i took greek myth class so i can i can do this easy and the question was something like oh who's persephone's husband and god of the underworld and you know i was just uh, looking, looking from the side, minding, trying to mind my own business, looking at my phone, and yes, of course, Hades, right? And then they chose Hermes. And then these girls, like, you know, flip the bird at the screen and say, oh my god, this is literally rigged. That, that doesn't make sense. It should be Hermes. I'm thinking to myself, no, it's not. You dumb. <laughs> And then they had another, another question. It was also another Greek myth question. And she said the same thing, that she took Greek myth, so she should know these questions very, very easily. I think it was something like, uh, who is the twin uh, sibling of Artemis? And... I was thinking to myself, oh, that's Apollo, a easy. And then frickin' chose Ares, Ares, why Ares? Ares is the god of war. I was so angry. Yeah.